Hello folks, Trans Gamer Girls back with you once again, and this time I will do a NES classic. It's called Super Mario Brothers for the NES. Today is Tuesday, June 2nd, 2020. And now it's time to start this classic. B is to sprint, and you of course use the D-pad to go forward or backward. Now while you're pressing B, A is jump of course. Now, when you press B while going forward, you go faster. If you're not, you are go like this. If you are, you're going like this. It makes a difference. Okay, Mushroom turns into Big Mario, and uh, Fire Flower turns into Fire Mario. Now, if you're a small Mario and you get a Fire Mario, well, if you get the Fire Flower as small Mario, all it turns into is Big Mario. Which I think is kind of stupid. And if you get hit, you go back to small Mario. There are eight worlds in total, four levels in each world. And I will say I've never beaten this game, but if I beat my game for the first time on this channel. Oh man, it's going to be historic. I hope that's the case, but we'll see what happens. Yes. I have made it to the final level one time. Unfortunately, fell short. right here. Go down here. Okay, get some coins. Sorry, I had an itch. Had an itch on my face, I'd scratch it, sorry. The quiet pause for a brief second. Alright. Got it. Flying Koopas are gone. Okay, now this enemy is a Koopa Troopa that I just killed just now. And this is a Flying Koopa Troopa. There are red and green types, by the way. I don't really see any difference, to be honest. Except that some fly, some don't. Okay, first castle of the game. Alright. Okay, be careful of these fire sticks. Okay. Ooh. Okay, towards the end of the level, Bowser spits out fire. Now, if you're a Fire Mario, you can try and kill Bowser with fireballs that I just did just now. Thank you, Mario, but our princess is another castle. Yep. Second world, level one. Okay, now these enemy, now this enemy is a Goomba. Simple, straightforward. They only go. Oh shit! I got hit. Yeah, they only go. Yeah, they only go in a backwards direction. Yeah, they only go in a backwards direction because I don't know. But some of them, if they bump into each other, you go in. They go into a forward direction. 
Now some of these levels do have vines, so you go up to play a bonus level. And by, by that, it's pretty much getting coins. Oh, I want to mention if you get a hundred coins, you get a one-up. Oh. Yay! Yes, a hundred coins is a one-up. Oh. Now, this is a piranha plant. Most piranha plants are in pipes. Most pipes have piranha plants. Do you hit one? Yes. If you hit one in small Mario, you lose a life. If you're at least big Mario, well, you go down to small Mario. Okay, let's go. This now nah, I'm not a fan of underwater levels. This one in particular. Let's play. Okay now the white things right here are called bloopers or bloopers. Is it bloopers or bloopers? Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, now these tiny fishies are called cheap cheeks. I know how to pronounce that. Yeah, if, you, if you hit either a blooper or a cheap cheap, well, you lose a life if you're small Mario, or you go down to small Mario, of course, if you're big Mario or up. Now, this isn't a too hard of a level, but you just gotta be really careful. Oh, I also want to mention that if you go down a bottomless pit, you lose a life automatically. Okay. Now, World 2-3. That's one I do not like. Let's see why. Yep, that's why. And that's fucking why. Now this level is notorious for cheap deaths. And I do not like that. Ooh. Ah, oh, what the hell? Well. Well, regardless, I cleared it. Second castle. Go up to Big Mario just to be on a safe side. Oh, well, good thing I grabbed the fire. I mean, mushroom. All right. Well, I'm gonna have to go under. Motherfucker! No, well, I had to open my, I had to open my fucking mouth. Anyways, if you're small Mario or big Mario, not fire Mario, you have to go, you have to go under Bowser or over Bowser. Keep my fucking mouth shut so that I don't fuck this up. There we go. Simple. Too easy. Wait. What the fuck do you mean too easy? I mean, wow. All right. Third world. It apparently takes place in the winter and nighttime. Those, those trees look like they've been snowed on. Yet, the ground doesn't have any snow. Well, apparently it does take place in nighttime. Now these things are called Hammer Bros. 
I consider them the absolute toughest enemy in this game. I mean, it's damn near impossible to avoid them. Unless you have a star. And that star is the invincibility. Where you will be immune to the enemies for a short time. Alright. And I know this game does not have a save feature. So damn obvious. Got another star, man. What your fucking mouth, Ricky? Let's see if I can get a one up. Yep. I know some of you might think, one up, are you freaking crazy? Nope. I just know the game. Alright, World 3 3. Basically a nighttime version of World 1 3. Alright, now well, let's focus. Okay, third castle. Okay, get the fire flower for a bit, I mean, fire Mario. Okay. Good. Okay, now on this level, there's the Lakitus, or Lakitus, I don't know how the fuck they're pronounced. If it's Lakitu or Lakitu. But either way, they throw these red shells and you have to avoid them at all costs. And they can be pretty tricky to avoid, so please be careful. might have time for one more. One more level in this. Oh, wow, that was close. Alright. You know what? We're going to stop here for part one. I'll see you for part two.